Welcome back. Good morning, or whatever time you're joining me. This is your reading for Friday, August 16th, 2024. And uh, you can see what I'm using here. Astro Matrix Tarot. I have allowed for reversals. Ooh, right there. Okay. Oh, okay, so in the morning, we want to be careful not to wake up and trip on a rug. <laughs> or it could be that we need to be open to more of a new adventure. Hmm. And then we have the Hierophant reversed. Oh my goodness, all three cards are reversed. And the Knight of Swords reversed. Okay, I don't mind getting this guy reversed. I... Uh, well, let's look at the theme of the day first. With the Hierophant reverse, we are not conforming. <laughs> we are saying no to dogma, to religious dogma, to um, restrictions, to how people want to tell us what we can do, who we are, what to say. It's Mercury retrograde, you know. Uh, there could be some resistance coming from the outside that you don't like. There could be some restriction that we don't like from the outside. Um, but I have a feeling that it's possible that this is the day to explore your inner authority. And if there's any just a weird thing that comes up, that, or maybe, maybe something comes up in meditation, because just look at the image here, you know, it, it's not the priest, <laughs> I mean, it's not the Pope, it's not the priest, it's meditation. And granted, we're looking at a guru of some type, I don't like guru kind of stuff, I just, I want everybody to find their own inner authority. Mentors are great, Mentors are wonderful, but sometimes it's, it's, it's taken way too far, or often it is. So, I think the main message here is to never give your authority up to someone else and let them make decisions for you. It's best to have an open conversation with someone that you trust, and then your own wisdom comes through. Uh, with the fool coming through in the reverse position, it's interesting to have you know two uh, majors out of um, out of the just only three cards. But when the fool comes to reversed, it can be just being a little foolish, being a little out of control, a little out of body, a little reckless, maybe taking too much of a risk. So we want to be careful in the morning. Be careful when you go out walking your dog. Be careful, you know, not to trip on an edge on the sidewalk. Be very cognizant of your feet and where you're going. You know, a lot of people are, here he is looking at the rows, but a lot of people are looking at their phones. Don't look at your phone when you're walking. Unless you just absolutely need to, then stop. <laughs> stop and look, do what you got to do, and then walk. Right? I mean, how many people have tripped just doing that? How many people have dropped their phones doing that? Uh, so you want to be careful. Don't let something in, your, in the outer world pull you out of your body, pull you out of your, um, your own focus. But if you don't get that lesson, and this could be, you know, this could be a good lesson for any day, right? If you don't get that lesson, you're going to be slowed down. It will teach you to slow down. I, no matter what's going on in the outer world, it's always good to not rush. I mean, unless it's an outright emergency and you're grabbing, you know, some a, a child away from a hot stove or or you know, rescuing somebody, then you go really quickly. But for the most part. I feel like the main message is just to focus on your inner world, find your inner authority, and then slow down, morning and evening. Take it slow today. And it is Friday. It is Friday, but 
you know, with all the astrological transits we have, got, you know, with Mars and uh, Jupiter are close together, very, very close together. And then Mars will move over next week. It'll be a little better. But uh, Mars and Jupiter can be fighting words because it's in Gemini. You know, and this is all this air energy. So if somebody has pushed your buttons in the morning and made you rebel then I uh, just find your inner authority and let that go. Maybe maybe this is about <laughs> tell it to the hand. <laughs> How about that? And don't get into a battle because it's not worth it. So, okay. Thanks, you guys. Let me know how you're doing.